For some, winter brings snow much fun. Skiing, sledding, and snowboarding. For many others, winter brings a season of challenging commutes, both on foot and behind the wheel. Some pedestrians choose to walk on plowed streets instead of slippery, snow-covered sidewalks. But what are the legal consequences of doing so if something goes wrong? The Michigan Supreme Court examined this chilling issue in the 1976 case of Zenny v. Anderson. On her way to work one winter morning, Eleanor Zenny chose to walk on the street instead of the slippery, snow-covered sidewalk. Zenny had previously fallen on the sidewalk. She instead walked along a well-traveled pedestrian snowpath, which happened to be on the side of the road. Other employees at Zenny's workplace also used the street as a safer alternative to the sidewalk. While Zenny was walking to work, Karen Anderson was driving along the same street. An eyewitness observed that the cold weather had clouded Anderson's windshield, which made it difficult for Anderson to see Zenny. The eyewitness saw the car traveling too close to the curb, which caused Anderson to hit Zenny. Zenny suffered serious injuries. Zenny brought a negligence action against Anderson in state court. In her defense, Anderson argued that Zenny was contributorily negligent. Anderson reasoned that Zenny's failure to use the sidewalk violated a Michigan statute that prohibited pedestrians from walking on streets if sidewalks were provided. Under Michigan case law, violation of a penal statute constituted a prima facie case of negligence. The jury ruled in favor of Zenny. The Court of Appeals reversed. Zenny appealed to the Michigan Supreme Court.